Top 15 Job Interview Questions and Answers Job interview questions can be tricky and challenging, but there are some general guidelines that can help you prepare for them. The key is preparation and practice. Job interviews are nerve-wracking experiences that can leave you feeling vulnerable and unprepared. However, it's important to remember that job interviews are much easier and more effective if you take the time to learn how to answer the questions. Like this video and subscribe to this channel, so you never miss out on any important job finding videos for yourself, your family, and friends. You don't have to be perfect, but you should strive for excellence. Why is it important to prepare for a job interview? What might not be obvious is that your interview skills and talents can be measured by what you do before the interview. If you start your job search early, share your qualifications early, and meet with as many people as possible, you will have time to practice responding to specific types of questions. A good way to get started is by identifying the things employers are looking for in your resume. This can help you identify which things you should emphasize during the interview to increase your chances of getting the job. The following is a list of some of the most commonly asked job interview questions and examples of answers. Use these examples to help tailor a response to questions during your own interview. Number 1. Why do you want to work for our company? I want a position where I can apply my skills, describe them, and expertise in order to help make your company successful. At the same time, I would like to see my skills flourish as I continually grow and expand my knowledge with the company. Number 2. Tell me about yourself. I am a fiercely competitive person. And by competitive, I mean that I will do anything in my power to help my company succeed. This includes going the extra mile, whether it's working late to help finish some last-minute content before the launch of a new product or spending hours on end looking at photos of people and their living spaces on Instagram to try to find inspiration for ads. Number 3. What are your strengths? I am a strong and confident person, who is willing to take risks. I have a strong work ethic, and I'm always looking for ways to improve myself. I'm also very passionate about what I do, which makes me motivated to learn new skills and explore opportunities that come my way. Number 4. What's your greatest weakness? My greatest weakness is that I'm too hard on myself. I always feel like when I make a mistake, even if it was a minor thing, it's really hard for me to give myself a break. Make sure you focus on something you can improve upon that's not going to paint you in an unfavorable light. Number 5. Where do you see yourself in 5 years? I see myself as a hardworking and ambitious person who will accomplish great things in the coming years. I believe that my drive and passion will help me succeed at any task I take on. In 5 years, I picture myself as very successful in this company and looking forward to continually meeting and exceeding all expectations. Number 6. What do you have to offer that other job candidates don't have? I don't know what other candidates can offer, but here's what I can, then list your skills and how they can benefit the company. Number 7. What are your salary requirements? My expectations are that my salary is consistent with my qualifications and experience. I'm sure it wouldn't be too difficult to come to a fair agreement. Number 8. Which is more important to you, money or work satisfaction? Although money is essential to being able to live, work satisfaction is equally important because, without it, I would not be able to make a good living and be happy. Number 9. Do you have any questions for us before we decide on whether to offer you the position or not? You can ask questions, such as. What can I expect the job role to involve? What is a typical workday like? Is this a new position, or am I filling in for someone who is leaving or no longer with the company? What are the biggest challenges a candidate faces with this role? Number 10. How would your experiences help you in this position? I have two years of experience as a marketing intern, and I've also worked in other positions such as customer service and retail. I have a strong work ethic, strong problem-solving skills, and the ability to work independently. Number 11. How do you handle pressure in a stressful situation? When I am in a high-pressure situation, it is important to stay calm and remember that there is no point in panicking. Some helpful strategies I practice are taking a break, identifying my strengths and sticking to them, and asking for help from others. Number 12. What is your biggest accomplishment? I am proud to have helped provide care for over 300 critically ill children and their families through our hospital's pediatric intensive care unit. Number 13. 
What do you consider your greatest achievement? My greatest achievement was working with the talented physicians at Children's Hospital of Eastern Ontario to design a new pediatric intensive care unit. We had great input from patients, doctors, nurses, and caregivers to create a state-of-the-art unit that increases safety, security, and comfort. Number 14. How would you describe yourself in three words? Three words that describe me are, friendly, hardworking, and reliable. Number 15. What is the one thing that would surprise me about you? I'm a stay-at-home mom and love to cook. I have a lot of Culinary Institute of America certificates, and I love to experiment with new recipes. How to end a job interview on a positive note? It is not easy to end a job interview on a positive note. But it can be done with the right words. Here's how to end a job interview on a positive note. Show your enthusiasm by asking questions and being interested in the company. Ask for feedback after the interview and follow up with an email or call. Thank the interviewer and let them know what you will do next. Finally, you can say something along the lines of, thank you. It was a pleasure meeting with you and learning more about your company. I hope all went well with the interview and that I can count on your input over the phone or by email. If you have any feedback for me, please let me know. Subscribe by clicking the button on your left and watch the next video here to your right.